as engrossed in this as we should be. It's fine. It's okay. We've all seen this. Everyone will be fine. Yeah. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> Ooh, oh, Victor Milgram. Last name address for the moment. Last name. Oh, damn, that's where we are. Oh, his face so is in far enough. Oh, 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 is that what it says? First, I'm trying to read that middle one. Once it in for the first degree. Murder. Arson? No, ar- arson. arson. Yeah, it says arson. Oh, so as he's... well as various. So he's the flamethrower. Death man. threats. Yeah. He's that's gonna be sitting <laughs> around. <laughs> It's gonna be super loud. I did not mean to like lean over the microphone too. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, what is that? Oh yeah! <laughs> Death threats. Ta-da. Ta-da. <laughs> what are we celebrating? It's a good up. question, though, isn't it? Like, of all the things you could put there, they went with shooting range. Yeah, but there's the like the those ski things, the cross country ski things, where they have to shoot things as well. Yeah, so they trek when, for when ages and out. then they shoot Is that things like and a then they track. triathlon thing. Yeah, what? one of those things, but it's like the cross country skiers do it. So I guess I'm like. There with the big so far. I could hit not paying attention. Yeah, and usually when you have like outdoorsy place, they have a random collection of things to do. Plus, uh, no shooting range would have things that would be knock offable because you've got to go and reset it every time someone's done. But I guess if it is just family, oh, are we on just the family owned bit? Is that something they've built because um, they wanted it? I don't know. Maybe the lodge is wow. on a ski <laughs> yeah. I'm now super attracted to him. <laughs> Heard my dream guy. Do the dance again. Anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle. That I also find it slightly odd that everybody seems to know how to shoot. I, I, I just, I don't get it. Well, you learn in the scouts. Well, if they've hung out there before. I was a brownie, so like. Okay. So you never went air rifle shooting. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, see, we, we like yeah. and and we, when we were in Brownies, it's still at the point of the girls don't want to go camping. Girls can stay inside and bake cakes and do stupid you stuff. You got a badge for it if you were good enough, though. Yeah. I, in fact, I don't even remember baking. I don't know what we did. We just did random exercises. I like. I, My explorer I uniform had one badge on it, other than like the. County badge. Was it for drinking stuff. beer? It was the beer drinkers badge. <laughs> I had like a sash thing and then yeah, you the, put all the your badges on your Scouts didn't do that. The um, Cubs did, I think, for a while, but then they went to just an arm. Okay. And then Scouts do the arm and then Explorers do the arm, but by the time you're in Explorers, you, you weren't earning badges. Because <laughs> who the fuck's going there You'd to give earn badges? You'd life. <laughs> Taking flasks so of fair, whiskey. We, to be fair, we started there when it was just changing over, so we were fairly old then. So. I, know, I, uh, I, I went back to Brownies as well as a helper. So I was doing the. Uh, this is how old the story is. I, I was doing the Millennium Volunteers scheme. Ooh. Yeah. I had to do like 200 hours of community service, so I joined the Brownies. Um, it's great fun. Yeah. Well, the Cubs was. They, I went and helped the Cubs for a bit. Um, everyone else got, like, all the real leader people who actually knew what they were doing, they were all owls, and I was Sparrow, because, uh, I was not good enough to be an owl. We're not Arkayla. No. I think that might, uh, is that Cubs? It 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 might be. It was Brown Owl for for my, for the eighth Brown Owl Brownie. (laughs) (laughs) Then we set up. Network, network scouts, and that came when we because that's eighteen onwards. So our meeting place for a network was the pub. Oh, oh, it's a hotel and sanatorium. I miss that. <laughs> for a healthy body and mind. 
nice. Ah, so it's an X resort that they've bought out. Or they've bought a place on. I don't Do know, I wasn't was reading called... his subtitles. And apparently it was called Blackwood before someone burnt down the sanatorium. <gasps> Maybe that's where they've got the giant bath. the bath? Maybe it was like an old school like hydrotherapy unit. Or something even creepier. Oh, it's not even flicking through. It was just on the bath and it flicked over. It did. <gasps> someone's going to spy on someone in that bath. They're going to think that they're going to get a good show, but then they're going to see someone die. See, I think right about now, I, I'd be thinking, you know what? No. Um, I'm going home. I would not get into that box. I would also not be making this journey after dark. You go that way, I'll go home. Yeah, yeah, I'd, I would be pretty much back in the car, headed home. Just like going to the prom. Yeah, I don't think I would get in a cable car that unless you I'm yourself to operating. To the yeah, no. Because who, when, when was the last time that cable was maintenance? Because that's a word. Like. That might not have been looked at for a year. It could be broken further up the line. I would yeah. imagine that the ski resort is just is run by someone and they've just bought a place on it. I hope so. I would imagine. No, there was a line about they bought the mountain. It was a good idea. Who buys a mountain? mountain. <laughs> yeah. So I assume that there was a, they own the entire resort, which is why there's all these big gates and everything that's off. You know what? Let's that's weird. Why would you buy a resort? And if you were, because you've got something to hide, clearly. Oh, that's probably why the the house is so big. Because it used to be a hotel. Because uh, someone made a comment about the house being huge, but I suppose it's not a regular house. Oh, because it's it's, it's, main, it's the main lodge. It's yeah. the main ski lodge. So the teacher made him move to the front. Weird. It's like, yeah, I understand buying a place in a ski resort, but the maintenance costs. It's just impractical. No, you just wouldn't do it. Yeah. I mean, if you have to go to this much trouble to get your visitors to your lodge, how are you going to get your workmen there? This might be one of those things where it's like, we're rich, the resort is it's on the way out. We'll we, maybe it. we'll buy it, use it for a few years, and then after that, yeah. reopen it. it. Sell it on or reopen it as a resort and just make the profit. But the, you'd still hire staff to maintain it, because you would have to. You're saying yeah. they haven't. Yeah, but well, have you seen any staff? Yeah, exactly. Other than creepy machete cats? Yeah, but they don't have to be there. Yeah, own. maybe he is staff. Maybe all the murderers are staff. <laughs> Skeleton <just> staff. <laughs> that haven't been paid. <laughs> no, they're, they're really pissed off that they bought the mountain and they're trying to scare them off. So maybe. It's a proper that really, scooby, yeah, scooby really. It's a scooby plot. They'd have got yeah. away with it too. Confident, trusting, irreverent. Irreverent. Nobody wants to be described as irreverent. <laughs> See, that's what threw me, is she says new people, but everyone knows each other. Is this the right way? Are we going the right way? Jessica, over here! Are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck. Is that not always your first thought when someone calls you? You're having a stroke? But not just a regular one, like a really weird one. Yet further proof that you should not be making this journey. Yeah. I was say, there was, was there only one car on that cable? That's a really inefficient cable car for that distance. You'd have at least two. Because they would do oh, that. Oh, oh, your butterfly effect's updating. Oh. What did you do? I didn't do anything. But it updated. Unless I wasn't looking and I was supposed to make a decision. <laughs> it's possible. Uh, Explain. Oh, too late. Damn. <laughs> Tool! That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosing around in other people's nostrils. Uh... Yeah, I, I tried. <laughs> <laughs> that expression, expression was amazing. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. Alright, alright. Let's just get up to the library. I'm getting tired of all this nature and junk. 
you guys go ahead. Freaking nature. <laughs> Shoot the hell out of it. If he's already I mean, tired of all this know, nature, he's got a long weekend ahead of him. Why is she, why is she being that? coy about waiting for Mike? Like, the I mean, boyfriend and girlfriend. I'm just <laughs> uh, no, I genuinely don't. Oh, I'm not bothered. Why is she having to wait for him? Surely they should have arrived together. Uh, not necessarily. No, that's a good point. Like... If you were gonna meet some people on the top of a mountain, would you not think, do you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna take someone along for the ride. Yeah, here. someone like, who's never been there before. You're gonna she's you would get an escort. Not, not that kind of escort, but you know. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. You would not want to get lost on top of the mountain. Vicious, active, motivated. motivated. No. And he was that vampire in Twilight. I may have Wikipedia'd him. <laughs> oh, look how mammy he is yeah. carrying the bags. So yeah. chivalrous. He looks like he should have had one stuffed under his arm as well. <laughs> with the way he's walking. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe they thought no, that. his balls are freezing. <laughs> oh, maybe that's that bag that went missing or goes missing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You got it. Michael. You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael. Yeah, I, I almost like hit you. I, 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 like, I totally hit you down. This is why she also kind world. of kicked him out. Always playing those Hydra jokes. <laughs> I do like the fact that everyone is like dressed appropriately for the weather. Yeah, and quite like realistic outfits. Yeah. Uh, welcome, Miss Rotten. Welcome. Things are nice. Yeah, yeah, welcome, Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now. <laughs> this is super awkward. Okay. This is not that you've said it. it. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good? You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna wow. make out. <laughs> <laughs> I really Same. hope he actually acted that <laughs> when he said that Same. one. <laughs> don't worry. I mean, let's just, let's just pretend he did. Yeah. Oh. It's a baby. <laughs> So is she like a little bit gothic, or is she just not come into the light yet? Is she actually all the bags? She doesn't tell. Yeah, yeah, I don't think she's gothy. She's pasty. But then again, her her fingernails look like they might be black. A lot of eyeshadow. This really can't wait. It's interesting because there's not a lot. I know it gives you the descriptors for each character, but there's not actually a lot to go off when they're all wearing huge coats and stuff. It's quite. It's interesting. Normally, you would make the no, difference. It said she's persuasive, so I assume she always gets him to do All what right. she wants. Fine. Well, he was carrying the bags and everything. Yeah. yeah. Pack horse with the rest of the way, but you owe me one. Excuse me. Well, then we're even at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. Wow, I'm going kind of harsh. Thank you. He's been a bit bitchy about it. It's like, yeah, I'll take the bags, but you know. I take back my chivalrous comment. Doing your favor. <laughs> well, now he's going to turn up with loads of bags, and everyone's going to be like, how much shit did you bring, man? <laughs> he's going to get all of the shit. Okay, so at first, I thought Mike was like the total dick of the group, and that's how it's supposed to come across. But my theory is that he's the guy that comes across that way, but is actually pretty okay. And then Matt is the opposite, and he makes a big deal of the yeah, I'm the kind guy. But then I'm, underneath, I'm so such a nice guy, but actually is just a little bit annoying. Oh, hello. Somebody's getting a little. Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm not in the friend zone kind of way. 
See, okay, the other thing I don't quite get is the amount of time people are spending using those binoculars. <laughs> like, really? Yeah, they cost loads of money. <laughs> I wonder how well we're gonna handle this when we don't know what's coming. <laughs> I think we'll have to start. Oh, you haven't seen? I thought you watched them with me. No. Okay. I hadn't paid that much attention to it, to be totally honest. She's always uh, forthright. So she'd encourage. Probably. No, I think aren't you encouraging her? Or no, it's it's telling him to take a look. Sounds yeah, terrible. I'm playing as her. Oh, oh, I see, yeah, because yeah. you already saw them. Encourage. She would always tell him what was going on. Uh, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. She doesn't seem that happy with that decision. <laughs> oh, look at them hugging. Bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. Uh, damn it. I think they're reading a lot into a hug. Yeah, it's just a hug. Yeah, they are all horny like teenagers, though. <laughs> yeah, but it's just a hug, <laughs> and you put like eight million layers on. It's you're on top of a mountain. Mm, let's read the book. But her phone is flashing at her. That looks that like looks a lot like. Fiction. Yeah, that looks like a <laughs> sexy book. <laughs> That's not the sort of book you read in public. <laughs> but who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a simple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to this strapping military? She stepped into character pretty quickly there, company. didn't she? Yeah, she loves it. I always hated that school stopped us from uh, throwing snowballs. Yeah, throwing snowballs. Oh, 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 oh! Because it's like, oh, you might roll the rock into it by accident. No! It's, this is freshly, like, it's fresh. No! Tennis ball was always good. Because you could only just wrap a bit of snow around the tennis ball. Oh, I wish it was that. So it's still bad. Since, since he left S.H.I.E.L.D. his aim has become terrible. Hello. I only have the one, like, <laughs> serious hey, to go out there, but you know. Oh, I almost missed that one. <laughs> so boom shock like <laughs> So what was the last time you guys had a snowball fight? Just out of interest? Uh, I had one with some kids when we were at uni. What, don't hit the bird? Yeah, I was gonna say, why are you Oh, oh, oh my, what did you I do? I wasn't paying attention! I was just like, oh, Tanya. Why did you do that? Yeah, I was just like, what are you doing? <laughs> I didn't realise it was the bird. Oh, How small did How you think that you've got? You killed it! <laughs> you killed the bird. Oh, oh no. Oh, my God. oh, he's just gonna carry on, like... No, the fun's gone now, okay? A no, bird died. Care. This just got real. Oh no! I really. <laughs> no! I didn't mean to! Alright, alright. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? No, like, the question is do I go back and fix this? Nope. <laughs> I don't think you can. Yeah, we can't uh, now. No. Now you've become like um, an anti hero. I would avoid snowballs. Yeah, I don't think we trust you with a snowball anymore. <laughs> how many That's how Mike that? died. <laughs> you already killed one thing. Wow. Snowball to the head. Later, buddy. Uh, endless reserve. Did you hear that? Oh. 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 Yeah, like... oh. oh my god. That's because you killed the bird. It is. Yeah. You could have left it there really and died. Close. I would have been us. mad different. Yeah, I mean, wow, if you hadn't pulled us out of the way. Oh, let's get out of here. Yeah. Wow, I wonder if they could have died that early on then. Possibly. 
That would have been cool. Or at least impaled. He would have died at least. Imagine the story at the end. Oh my god, all these teenagers were brutally killed. What about these guys? Oh, oh that's that. That, that, <laughs> uh, that was actually not me. Okay, so we're the bad guy again? Or the survivor. Yeah. I just don't trust him. Not even a little bit. Of course not. He's a psychiatrist, dude. Nobody this trusts time, him. We're going to try to understand. Well, I'll, you know, yes. when Emily qualifies, I'll probably have to. She's my sister. But there's always an exception to the rule, isn't there? There is. But saying that, you would probably never use her because she's your sister. That's true. That is true, yeah. Yeah. Which means that you instinctively don't trust her. Well, yeah, because she's my sister. Exactly. Like, you don't want to don't trust her you to don't keep put something the past the family, do you? Oh. Who worries his most? Uh, well, he looks kind of cool. He looks quite chilled. Um, I can't see her face, so... She intimidates me more. He looks approachable, you know. But it's just generalising men or women. Yeah. Well, I think men are more straightforward than women. Like, if, if a guy's annoyed with you, he'll tell you. Girls, not necessarily. I don't know, but men don't communicate. <laughs> oh, that's true. Well, um, I mean... <laughs> oh, I'll give you for men. Okay. <laughs> oh, turn that page. Crowds. Anything could be in See, a crowd. See, planes aren't scary. Flying, potentially. But planes themselves, not really. Like, I've been in a crowd of people and, or been in a lot of people and felt like I couldn't breathe, whereas I've never felt unsafe on a plane. The more I think about flying, the scarier I find it. If I could just not think about Dang. it. Think. What if you were afraid of both drowning and heights? I think What if you were afraid are. of drowning at a great height? But I like rats, they're fine. Yeah. Trudy had pet rats. Like, they both cool. are fine, I suppose. It, like, in the grand scheme of things, it's more likely that a snake would kill you. Venomous. Yeah. I mean, you can catch plague from a rat, but there's a cure for that now. So. Yeah, yeah but there's. Yeah, there was a house There's episode. quite a lot of anti venoms yeah. have been developed as well. Uh, oh, you're not wrong. Guns. Guns are scary. Guns aren't scary, people are scary. Yeah. I actually think knives are scary. Snake men are scary. <laughs> Snakes. Uh, Cockroaches are tiny, you can just kick the damn thing. Uh, I, no, I, think I think I'd, I'd probably have more of a reaction to a cockroach. Yeah, but that's yeah. because... I don't like the scuttly movement. Like, snakes are pretty chilled, usually. Yeah. But you've gone for the thing that's not venomous or lethal. It didn't ask you what was the more legitimate yeah. threat. It asked you what. So I, I did that with the snake and the rat because I feel barely even about both of them. I like the way they've gone for a nice, pleasant scarecrow, <laughs> but a really hideous. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, that clown. That clown scares me. Yeah, it's fine. He's all good. Look at him. What the scare? Oh, hello. No. Okay. Does anybody choose crows on this page? A Someone would. Crows are really a murderer cool. would. <laughs> do <you> think? <laughs> because it's a murder of crows. You're doing very well. <laughs> yeah, but it is, <laughs> isn't it? Sorry, that took me forever. It is a murder of crows. I like how we both made an expression that will not be fit to the voice out. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answer. You're clearly more awake than we are. How does the metronome help? Are we help? expecting to turn a page and be like faced by the dead bird that I killed? <laughs> and just oh let me, and let the guilt get to me. <laughs> spiders are creepy. Yeah, do it. That's spiders. a no brainer for me. Yeah. Do not like the spiders. Spiders are cool. Mm. Uh, I don't fear needles, whereas I suppose a lot of gore might make me feel sick. Dislike needles. Do do. There's dislike. Yeah. What about a zombie clown? Uh, oh, what? No, that's just the stuff nightmares are made of. Combine those two pictures right there and you've got an awesome enemy. I did that. Of those two pictures, 
The zombie looks kind of cutesy. Like, he's a Scooby-Doo zombie almost. That clown, however... That clown has the intent to kill, whereas the zombie that's is That's a Stephen is King clueless. clown. Yeah. yeah, the zombie could just be chilling in the background of Thriller. Like, that's fine. Like, the zombie could lose its eyes and just start walking into a corner, whereas the clown's gonna come for you. <laughs> that's not a dog. That's quite blatantly a wolf. <laughs> that is yeah. clearly a wolf. <laughs> a very... Angry, uh, hungry wolf. Hungry like the wolf. I love storms. <laughs> no, I actually, since <laughs> since having some, like, not really very specific trauma of being looking out, trying to find the rabbits in the storm, uh, I, I now, like, get really anxious when there are storms, and uh, I, I used to love the, them. What about the storm in America when we were driving along and James was driving and it rained? really heavily that was pretty awesome there you go but no it, like if i'm if if i'm at home and there's a storm outside i can't, I can't it's really weird oh, i go like, i, I go upstairs and open the, open the curtain it's the because curtain. that's yeah. what i was used yeah, to like but it's is your mind linking it to an event yeah yeah, yeah but so it's, a, it's, it's such a silly event like yeah <laughs> but yeah now i have like super anxiety there it's really but strange it's, it's like how one fine night will give me anxiety while I'm around the shop because of the number of years working in the shop. Home. Yeah. <sighs> so the you number can. of years where there was trouble. Oh, sorry, just as a previously on, even though we've been playing it straight. Previously on 24. Oh, I suppose because we're starting a new chapter, I guess. Yeah. Okay, so he has a machete there. Um, I, I thought it might it have was been a, the same bloke. Uh, uh, yeah, I thought the villain like had a flamethrower. Yeah, it might be a different bloke. That bloke might have just been scaring him. This bloke might have been trying to help them. Maybe. Because he did put his hand down. He's just a, a dude who goes around... Helping people. He's clearing a path using fire. Like a, like a friendly neighbourhood yeah, version. He is the maintenance man. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he is. Yeah, because he put his hand down to help you out. That's true, actually, because... So much so that she did. was like, fuck my friend, I want some help. Yeah, and then you kill the bird as well. Like, I'm not I'm sure. still traumatised with myself. I'm going to wake up in the middle of the night and go, <laughs> the bird. Nine hours till dawn. I really hope this lets me open up a new save file without going to a different account. He looks a bit stoned there. That's an unfortunate picture. Thoughtful and loving, really? Complex... He doesn't look well. He doesn't look thoughtful or loving. Or complex, to be honest. It's a bit high. A bit I carry around a guitar that I can't play. You got a spare million lying around, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I think I left in my other jacket. Listen to Nirvana. I'm deep. Yeah. It's deep, dude. More or less, but it was. Yeah, but if you ever listen to it on weed. 